Hello and welcome! When you buy a PSP game from the PlayStation Network, it comes in this neatly compressed PVP file. This file can be played perfectly fine on any compatible hardware, like a PlayStation Portable, downloaded to a PlayStation Vita, or on Adrenaline. And it can even work in certain emulators. But what if you wanted to explore a PSP game's files? Or perhaps maybe you want faster loading times? Well, what you can do is use the ISO to PVP tool and extract the game's UMD disk image directly from it. And today I'll show you how to use it. But first, a message from this video's sponsor. Today's video is sponsored by 16-Bit Store. At 16-Bit Store, we design and 3D print a variety of items for your video games and consoles. From our styluses to our display stands, we take pride in our designs for all products that we create and the finished quality of our prints. If you are interested or just want to help out the channel, why not visit the 16-Bit Store today? And if you use offer code 16BitReview on Etsy, you'll get 15% off your order when you buy two or more items. As always, a quick reminder, please only use backups of your own games. Just because you bought the game digitally or have it physically doesn't mean you have the right to download it from a pirate site and use the copy instead. You only have the right to archive or backup copies of the games which you already have the license to. If you want more information, please check out our Realms legal video from us or extra credits video, Do You Own Your Games, for more details about this matter. So first, we need to be able to back up our PSP games, and there's two ways to get a PSP game backed up. The easiest and my recommended way is by backing up the PSP game from a PSP itself. So just download and install the game to a PSP and copy it over to a Windows PC. However, if you only happen to have a PlayStation Vita, there are still a way to back it up, though you have to do it through Content Manager and decrypt the Vita image that you get backed up. I made a separate video going through that since it is a bit of work to get it to work. But once you have your hands on a PVP file on a PC, all you need to do is just download the ISO to PPP software from its website, and when it's done, launch the application, select the PPP you wish to extract, hit the go button, and mere moments, you will decompress your game image and turn it into a virtual disk image file. With this ISO file, you can play your PSP games with a PSP that has custom firmware installed or on a Vita with adrenaline. And from my testing, the ISO loads a little faster than a PVP. You can also explore the game's file when you mount it on a computer as a virtual disk image. And there are many things which can be found by looking around, like the game's soundtrack in an AT3 file format, or even a game collection's ROMs if you know where to look. But this isn't all that the ISO to PVP tool can too. You see, if you load a game disk into the software, it will convert it into an unsigned PVP file. The benefits of compressing your game disks is that it will have a smaller footprint on your game systems at the cost of slightly longer load times, which I personally think is worth it. Though, small warning, if you are converting ISOs to PVPs, especially older uh, PSP games that were made for the original model, you might have some compatibility issues when running it in adrenaline. So just keep that in mind when you're making your games and trying to figure out which games to convert. Also keep in mind that the ISO to PVP tool only will work for PSP games. PS1 games are formatted in just a bit of a different format and will need to be extracted with another piece of software called PS Extract. I'll show you how to use that in another video. But anyways, that's how you can extract your PSP ISOs from PVP titles. I hope the video helps you do whatever it is you need to do with it, and I also hope you have yourself a good day, and as always, take care.